Welcome back to the channel. Jack with Grant Chronicles here uh, with another uh, trailer reaction review. So uh, we're going to be watching um, Squid Game uh, Netflix series. I This kept popping up when I was trying to watch <laughs> movies on Netflix and I'd stopped the trailer because I once it was like a little bit blip into it. I was like, man, this seems like a show I could get into. Uh, and then I kind of forgot about it. But now I've seen it talked about everywhere and I'm like, man, I got to watch a trailer and maybe watch the series hopefully soon after because we kind of have a habit of watching one series at a time. Um, we're currently on Modern Family, but I feel like if this is just a straight up X amount of episodes instead of like seasons upon seasons of Modern Family, then maybe uh, I can convince my girlfriend to maybe swap to this to check it out, So, which I'm hoping. So yeah, anyhow, really excited to see the trailer because the little blip, like I said, that I saw before, was uh seemed interesting so uh, let's give a watch here yeah just the style of the tra trailer alone <laughs> This is different than what I remember the trailer opening being that I saw. That eliminated a lot. It's hard for me to watch, but also read the. that um let me get rid of that yeah so that looks sweet <laughs> that's definitely like a movie that i want to see i'm not much for a lot of gore and whatever but it seems not to be quite the case with this hopefully but uh yeah i'm not familiar with any of the actors or anything i don't think one looked familiar but i don't know from what it uh but that looks pretty sweet. <laughs> so now I kind of like excited because people are talking about it. And I'm hoping it's not overhyped because they seem to do that with a lot of series lately and try to generate just almost just whatever buzz they can. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Uh, it reminded me kind of like get like a thought of like Hunger Games, except I don't know. It did seem like they some wanted to be there. I don't know if some wanted to be or not or if it's a mixed combination of that or what but because then there's Running Man like that's kind of what came to my mind when it was like when they were running the red light green light just for it was not the same but in there you have bracelets on or whatever and they try to escape and whatever but yeah but now I understand a meme a little bit better <laughs> when it was something about the red light people like running red lights or whatever and then it showed a picture of like that uh, machine, little girl. Yeah. <laughs> so now I kind of get that a little bit more. This trailer was not the one 
that was playing automatically, I don't think, on Netflix when I was uh, checking it out. So I don't know. There might Maybe there's a teaser and maybe there's a few more. This is just the uh, official one that I found when I looked it up. But it definitely looks like a series that I'm like highly interested in seeing. Uh, I thought the trailer was really well done. Very intriguing. Again, like they're going to be able to like... I figured when they asked if nobody wanted to play, tell us now. I was like, I have a feeling if you say you don't want to play, you're effed. And yeah, seems like that's the case. But... So, yeah, and then Battle Royale. I've never actually seen Battle Royale, but a lot of games, like, uh, a lot of uh, movies and stuff have taken inspiration from it, but, um, I don't know. I always thought that movie was going to be super brutal, so this one might be too. So if I can see this, I'll probably be able to finally watch Battle Royale, but, yeah, because I was kind of like, I had friends talk about it, and I just never really... I just kind of avoided it because I can cringe a little bit, <laughs> but, and I'd imagine there's going to be scenes in here that are going to be hard for me to watch, probably, uh, just from that little blip, so, I don't know, I thought that was a really good trailer, though, um, yeah, and honestly, I probably would give it a, uh, ooh, oh my nuts rating of, man, I don't know, I'd, I'd say, I want to say 8.75. I always get conflicted here. Because I just, like, it's been a long time, I think, before, like, a trailer, like, blew me away. And sometimes I was just excited because I knew the content. Probably The Punisher, <laughs> which was a Netflix series. Um, but I, honestly, I would say, uh, I'm going to play it, say, I'm going to say 8.75. I want to say 9, but yeah. So it's it's generally in that area. Oh, and then uh rating so because it does make me really excited to check it out it was hard to both watch what was going on and reading subtitles though but that's with anything so i'm that's what i'm kind of worried about with it uh watching that i've also wanted to really watch this movie called parasite and i just it, the trailer was awesome and it, i like the actors in it and i was just like yes but then i was just yeah i gotta like be in a mood and I'm, Sometimes I almost feel like you almost have to watch it twice depending because you don't want to miss something. You're trying to read it. You don't want to miss that and then go back and read it again. And you're trying to focus on the film. That's the only like downside with like subtitles. But it usually more often than not, it beats dubbed. <laughs> so I don't know. But yeah, so I'm uh, excited to check this out. And uh, what about you? Actually, you may have already seen it because it already came out. Um, like I said, there's been a lot of buzz generated around it, and I've been trying to avoid spoilers, so if you could avoid spoilers down below, that'd be appreciated. And, uh, yeah, because otherwise, um, yeah, just let me know if you've uh, seen it, what you thought of it, just in general terms. Uh, is it worth checking out? If you haven't, does this trailer make you interested in checking it out? And, uh, yeah, so I'm um, curious to what you uh, have to say below, and uh, appreciate you checking out the video. Until next time, take care.